I look so bad. You don't. Because your hair length is so thin. Look at my big crusty cold sore. Fuck that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today is actually the 9th of November. I have not started my monthly vlog yet because I've had I've had I've had a week, haven't I? You have had a week. Yeah. <laughs> Anne Marie's here with me. Somebody there. <laughs> <laughs> Um, it's Amory's graduation today. I just did her makeup. She did a beautiful job. It's not finished yet. She has put lipstick on, but oh yeah, she did a beautiful job <laughs> on my eyes. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's been a week. I've got a massive cold sore because I'm really run down. I cut my hair last month. It looks so cute. Thank you. <laughs> um, and it's currently greasy. What the hell is with short hair being greasy all the time? Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so I was at the Penny's Christmas press day the other day, so I filmed a few bits, but I didn't vlog in the day, I just like filmed while I was in there. Um, so I'm gonna insert that now. I'm gonna show her to you because she's not ready. Well, I don't have my tripod, but I'm disheveled, but my face is beautiful. <laughs> Yeah, this is the makeup I did. Bra, oh, focus, she's in a hurry. Anyways, this is her this is her face. <laughs> and this is her outfit. I think you look so cool. Thank you. I just tie my tie because it's yeah. not a skill I have. My will do it. <laughs> her parents are waiting outside. So she's gonna go run and graduate Thank and be a grown up, name. kind of. <laughs> look how crazy the rain is. Oh my god, it looks like a movie. It's very much later on now, and Amory is now graduated, so automatically is a lot smarter. Automatically. Welcome to the graduated <laughs> life, the graduate life. Um, I'm finished work, Woo! and I'm gonna go to the range and get a new jigsaw. I did a jigsaw show to you later on sometime. It's covered in makeup at the minute, so we won't <laughs> we won't turn the camera around. But Amory looks unreal, and I just wanted to show you because she looks so so nice. This is the whole reason I'm, I'm doing this clip. <laughs> Yeah, this is like her whole outfit. This new jacket and I love it. <laughs> <laughs> so I have like no shame right now because I love it though. Jacket. Look, I'm gonna zoom in a bit. It's all, it's all out of focus. Oh, I love it so much. And show the inside. <laughs> so so cool. I don't know. I just I'm really all dressed so nicely. No, I don't. Yes, you do. I dress nicely and I love her shoes house, as well. That's rare. I just, I just love you so much. <laughs> so I have this jigsaw completely done um, and I really loved doing it. It was such a lovely jigsaw and it's so Christmassy and lovely. I really, really like it. Um, but I just bought a new jigsaw because I actually find it like so therapeutic to do these kind of things, like not be on my phone the whole time. I just do this in the evenings and stuff this week and I really liked it. I don't have space to put it anywhere. Does anybody, does anybody know of a way that you could like store jigsaws like this? I think I'm just gonna have to break this one up and put it back into the box for now, just because I wanna start this one. But I'd love to, I don't know, like put it into, you know those things where like, it's like um if you go into like a bookshop or something, there's loads of um, posters and you can like layer them or something like that. Like I love to have something like that that I could just put all my jigsaws into. Cause like they take so long to do and I love doing them, but I hate breaking them up because it's like, almost feels like it was all for nothing <laughs> but I want to start my new one tonight so 
<laughs> I think I'm gonna have to break it up. Okay, my battery is flashing. I look like shit. I was not meaning to vlog today, but something has just come through my door that I was not expecting today. I made an order last night, like nine o'clock for so stuff on beauty bay because it was like 30 percent off and i was like oh my god they got to me so fast but then i was like no dpd dropped this off it can't be that and i was like oh my god what did i order and then i remembered i ordered the kaylee by so Sue palette oh my god i'm if this is what it if this is what that is i'm so excited to get <laughs> it is oh my god i'm so excited this is what the packaging looks like oh my god i'm so excited Oh my god, even the paper has so Sue on it. You probably can't see it. Oh, maybe you can. Oh, that's cute. They gave like um, a discount for ordering. Um, a 10% discount. That's very cute. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Well, it's very well packaged. Or protected. Oh my god. It's heavier than I thought. Oh my god, it's so much heavier. And it's like such a nice size as well. Like that's such a lovely size. Oh, look at the colours in the back. Oh my god. That's such a nice size to like travel with. Okay, let me try and open this now. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Ooh, it's in like a sleeve. I actually think all the Sosu stuff comes like that. I'm not sure though. Um, oh, look at this packaging. I'm sorry, but look at this packaging. So nice. Wow. Oh my god, I'm so excited. So excited. I actually have butterflies in my stomach. Like that's apps that's actually sad. <laughs> oh wow. I'm sorry, but can we just take a second? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I can definitely I've been watching all of like Kaylee's videos where she's like explaining the palette and explaining like her brushes and like her whole collection. So she has a whole collection now, it's not just um the eyeshadow palette, she has like three um, eyelash eyelash collection things and there's also like a brush collection as well I just went for the eyeshadow palette because I have enough brushes at the minute and the palette is called Urban Bible and I would swatch them but they're just too pretty I need to take pictures first but I did I was watching Hayden's videos and in it she said that she wanted the packaging to look a little bit like dirty or something so that like when you're messing around you're playing with it it looks like it's normal as opposed to it being like black and then like stuff going everywhere and getting dirty anyways this is just the design of the palette so I thought that was like super intelligent um but yeah it's a nice big like mirror on it as well and it's got some weight to it like it's very not very heavy but like it's not flimsy at all it feels really good quality oh my goodness I'm so excited by this <laughs> oh my god yay Good morning everybody. Um, I am headed into town today. I'm gonna have a look in pennies. I've seen some stuff on their Instagram that I'm really hoping is inside in town. So I'm gonna go and treat myself this morning. I also have a voucher from the Christmas event that I went to with pennies there the other day. So I have a little voucher. I don't know how much it's worth, but I'm just gonna go in and treat myself. Um, I'm not gonna bring my camera because it's about to go dead, but I'm gonna charge it and I might film a video when I come back. We shall see. But yeah, I'm excited. I haven't gone to pennies in like, a month. <laughs> it's a little bit later now. It's really really dark so that's why the oh my god my blusher looks really strong on camera. It is the night that Limerick turned on their Christmas lights in the city so we're gonna head in. I think they're turning on in about an hour so we're gonna get the bus in, watch the lights and have some drinks and stuff and just have a nice kind of Christmassy night. So we're gonna go do that now. I'm gonna bring my camera but I don't know how great my camera will be just because it in as you can see with this low lighting and my camera do not go well together so we shall see after having like a wonderful day. I, pff, how do I even say this? Do I say it? Do I not say it? This shouldn't be going out for ages so maybe I'll just say it. I have recently started my own business which is so bizarre, so crazy. It's something that was always in like 
you know, I was always thinking about it, but I never thought I'd do it until I was like 30 or something like that. Um, which, you know, I basically thought I would go out and work in industry for like a couple of years and eventually set up my own business. But it's just happened, the way my life has worked out, it's just happened to come early and just like, it's been the perfect time to start it now. So that is what I have done. Um, would I tell you about it? I guess I probably will. Um, it's basically a marketing company or it's not even necessarily a company, like it's just me. And I basically offer social media services, marketing service, services to businesses, any type of businesses. I am very lucky at the moment to have, to like all of my days are booked up for the next, the next like couple of weeks. And I'm pretty like this, as I'm recording this, it's like mid November. And I should have like work until the end of the year. So like I'm pretty solid in that. And hopefully going into the new year new year then like i'll bring on more clients and stuff but like i've been very fortunate to start out how i've started out um so hopefully it will continue and i do know that like i was speaking to somebody i was basically doing a course with the enterprise office today on like starting a business and the girl was like you talk yourself down so much she was like what you do and what you offer is actually really really good and um she was like you know a lot about what you're doing she was like um you need to stop like putting yourself down or being like oh i'm not you know I should have this I should have that she's like what you do have is really really good and loads of businesses need it so I was like thank you <laughs> but um yeah I, it was a really really good day I learned loads apparently like um I know from working through my mom's business that um the Limerick Enterprise Office are very very good the way I figure it is what I've heard from different businesses just from networking and stuff is that not every enterprise office um, is great but the Limerick one is really good and I think either the Carlo or Wexford one are really good I can't remember um but I'm happy that like I'm currently living in Limerick so I get to use Limerick Enterprise office um and like we learned so much today I have like so many like brochures and stuff to go through and I have like so much stuff to set up but it's all really exciting and it's mad <laughs> I can't wrap my head around the fact that I actually kind of have my own business at 24 <laughs> um but yeah also as well as me being as well as me being like so happy about it that's why i've been really inconsistent on social media and um, because i've been setting all of this up i've been working every hour that god puts in front of me and i have just been working myself to the bone so um <laughs> that is why i've just been a bit mia but hopefully the balance will work out soon <laughs> um yeah but that's what I've been up to. If you've wondered why I've been quiet, why YouTube videos haven't been going up every week, it's because I've literally been working at my laptop, at my desk or in my bed or on the sofa non-stop for the last couple of months. All of that was to set up the business and the business is only going like, I'm officially in business this week, which is kind of weird and scary, but it is what it is. Um, and everything so far is going great. And I will keep you updated as I go through all of this <laughs> i don't even know what to say i'm rambling it's been like seven minutes now anyways i got a delivery today when i was out from beauty bay it's obviously this week is black friday week so there's loads of sales on um i'm gonna actually buy a few more bits tonight i think depending on whether i got paid or not that is another thing about being self-employed invoices oh anyways um i i'm gonna open this up because they had 30 percent off which is to be honest the biggest sale i've seen beauty bay do in a long time so this is the first thing that i got it is the zulu palette by juvia or i don't know how to pronounce it juvia i don't know but i've seen raw beauty christie use these and i've seen a lot of makeup artists use these um i think a lot of people may not know about them because their palettes are so like bright and colorful that um it might deter somebody who doesn't like usually use you know colorful eyeshadows and stuff oh okay Oh, I actually bought this because I, I bought this specific palette, I think, because I've seen Steph from Breaking Beauty. I've seen it on her Instagram, I think. Like, I'm sorry, but look how beautiful this is. Oh, my goodness. And, the, like, the packaging of it and everything I really like. This is actually very similar to my Kaylee palette, like, the size-wise and everything. Actually, the Kaylee palette is slightly smaller. Um, but this feels a lot sturdier and a lot heavier. And I'd say the pans are probably deeper. 
and also in the Kaylee palette you get four by four 16 eyeshadows and then this one you only get nine so I don't know maybe they work out kind of the same but I'm really excited to use this I oh I thought that that was actually going to be red it's pink that's a little bit disheartening but anyways it's fine because the Kaylee palette came with a red so it's fine <laughs> anyways this was I think originally like 26 or 27 or something like that and it was down to like 15 16 so actually I have it in front of me this was 1644 so I thought that was like the cheapest I was probably ever going to get it and I really wanted to try the brand because they have some really beautiful eyeshadow palettes but they've always just been a little bit expensive that I'm like mm, will I try it will I not um but I tried it well I bought it now at the cheaper price so hoping it'll be good I also picked up the revolution make revolution um bake and finish luxury baking powder and um, that's what it looks like it's a lot smaller than I thought it would be but I think this was only this was only 3 92 with the discount I'm not sure what the original price was but just add 30% I guess um but I wanted to try this because I'm not really I've never really baked before like with my skin because my skin like especially like the outer part of my skin I would have very dehydrated skin I'm like mm, do I really need that so I'm just gonna try it I was like if I'm gonna try it I might as well try it with a cheaper brand and see how we get on um but yeah so I got that and then the rest of my order I think is actually from Makeup Revolution as well so I didn't get much to be honest I didn't get much I got two of the Makeup Revolution Conceal and Define concealers. I love these so much, but I run through them so quickly, like so freaking quickly. It's ridiculous. So I picked up two this time because obviously they were reduced. These were 315 each, which was and they're usually like six something, I think. So that was really good, I thought. Then I also picked up the foundation, the conceal and define foundation. I think I seen um I think I seen Ashton from Dramatic Mac. That's not going to focus. I think I've seen Ashley from Dramatic Mac using this and think she really liked it. So that's why I've picked it up. Um, and also because I really like the concealer, I wonder if the foundation is similar. So I will do, I'm going to do this series over on my Instagram. I know I had, I think I'd spoken about it here in one of the vlogs before that I was going to do it on YouTube. But doing it on YouTube, it just complicated things a lot and it just wasn't happening. So at least if I do it on Instagram, the production value of it doesn't need to be as amazing because Instagram videos can only be one minute long. Um, so yeah, basically I'm gonna do this series over on Instagram. It's gonna be called The Foundation Files and I'm gonna do them every Friday. So every Friday I'm gonna be trying a new foundation and, or well, like I'll have tried it obviously before and I'll have a full review of that like foundation. Um, but I'll show you like what my skin is like before, what the coverage is like, give you a full review. But I'm gonna do it over on Instagram just because um, a lot of the foundations that I have aren't new foundations, so I don't know whether people would actually be interested in watching like a whole like seven or eight videos about it or seven or eight minutes about it. But if I just give you a quick like one minute video, I'm like, look, this is what the coverage is like. This is how it looks on my skin. And then I can give you like in text, like here are the bullet points that are good or bad about it. So I'm going to do an Instagram and test it there. And I think that would be much easier for me to like actually do and keep up with than if I do it here on YouTube. Um, because with YouTube I was going to do like 10 foundations in the one video and break it up into a couple of different like parts but I just I don't know if anybody wa anybody would watch like a 40 minute video about foundations I know I probably would but anyways that was all I got from Beauty Bay I'm really excited to try my new Makeup Revolution bits and obviously this palette very excited to try this palette also I think it's really like trippy <laughs> which I kind of like but yeah, I'm exhausted <laughs> after all everything today. I forgot to put on lipstick today. That's how tired I was leaving the house. But and I didn't reapply it when I when I went to the courts because I was like, you know what? I don't care. <laughs> um, I need to do probably another two hours work tonight, and then I think we're having like a chill housemate evening. We're gonna play like cards and have music and just eat food and all that kind of stuff. So it should be a good night. But I will talk to you. I don't even know when because. I'm working for the rest of the week. I'm working Saturday. Oh my god, I'll talk to you Sunday because Anne Marie is coming down. I'm so excited. Um, Anne Marie is like one of my favourite people in the entire world and she's coming down to help me actually film a few videos and we're like collaborating creatively. <laughs> um, but yeah, she's going to be here Sunday. So I shall talk to you then.
Good evening everybody. I really wanted to vlog today but I was just so busy I didn't get a chance. But I just wanted to flip the camera around to show you what I'm dealing with. <laughs> I have my whole setup here. I have all of this here. All of that. Yeah. <laughs> In case you're uh, counting here, that's eight pennies bags. <laughs> um I am I've decided to do Primark Week or Pennies Week over on my channel for the first week of December. So it's like a video about Pennies Primark every day for five days. So I had Amory up with me today helping me film things, um, which was so helpful. I love having Amory here. She's so creative and she's so like just her presence I find um is really positive and it's just really helpful um to have her here with me so she was very good and came up to me and i really appreciate it thank you emery <laughs> um but i've loads of stuff in front of me and i need to like sort my life out because it's sunday evening it's like eight o'clock i need to go and have food i need to sort my life out for the week and i need to i need my office back so <laughs> i'm trying to like get through everything and um, i don't think this video will be going up until well after that video is done so basically like i'm doing five different things one of them is going to be about gift sets so that's over there I'm actually returning them because I don't need them I said that in the video um we also got like decorations for Christmas um and they all need to now go like out of my office I also picked up like general like clothes and stuff for like a normal haul well like not for the haul I just had them and then that spurred me on to thinking about Primark week but anyways um so yeah, that's what I was trying to do there. I was trying to do like a shot, like a slowed shot, like or an in like a detailed shot of the looks of the items, but it's just too dark and my lights aren't really working with it. It's just not working. So I think I'm gonna just film it like tomorrow morning when I have natural daylight. I'm gonna leave my backdrop up, but I leave it against the wall here so it's out of the way. Um I need to put clothes away, I need to wash makeup brushes, I need to put away makeup, I need to I need to sort so much out tonight and I'm feeling a little bit overwhelmed about it all because there's so much to do and I'm so tired and I need to edit stuff and oh there's just so much to do <laughs> but it was a really really good day I really wish I could have vlogged but when we were in town my camera went dead so we didn't get a chance and then we were back here we were racing against time to get stuff done so I just didn't get a chance we were obviously using the camera all day but I just didn't get a chance to like vlog properly but yes, I was very busy today, very productive, very happy with what we got done. I don't have too much left to do in terms of filming. I've like a video and a half left to film, which is really good. So like today I did three and a half videos, so I'm so happy with that. Did I? One, two, three. Yeah, I did four videos today, so I'm really happy with that. I just need to edit them all now. And I, have to e I still have to edit vlogs from like August and it's now nearly December. Yeah. <laughs> right, okay, I need to go and make a massive list and start checking it twice. <laughs>